Now, from the Global Montreal studios at the corner of Peel and St. Catherine in downtown Montreal, the Evening News with Jamie Orchard. Hi there, thanks for joining us. Well, an online radical Islamic organization has broken into the website of a small town off the western tip of Montreal. The group calling itself Mecca infiltrated the homepage of Terrasse Vaudreuil. The big question is why? The town thinks it may be a case of mistaken identity. Still, as Tim Sargent reports, it has some residents very nervous. Cheryl Brazo often goes online to visit her town's webpage. After all, the Taras Vadroy resident is also married to a town councillor. She was shocked to learn that the town's homepage had been hacked. Very surprised because who knows about us, you know? Not many people know about us. Residents logging onto Taras Vadroy's website were greeted with this picture and message from a radical Islamic group. It reads, hacked by Mecca, the Middle East cyber army. It continues. We are Muslims, and Allah we trust. For Allah we work. Screw you, Charlie Ebdo. Because we're a small town, we feel very safe and at home here. And when I see something like that, it, it makes me worry uh, for our safety. Brezzo doesn't think the online Islamic organization is planning to set up a terrorist cell in this town or that it will try to recruit residents to join a radical cause. Teresa Vadroy is a small bedroom community with less than 2,000 residents. Councillor Jean-Pierre Brezzo isn't worried for the public safety, but the attack exposes the town's online security level. Oh, we see that anything could happen at any time. The Sauté de Québec has started an investigation to see if the people behind the crime are local or are part of a foreign terrorist organization. Other North American cities have had their home pages hacked by the same group. This internet security expert doubts whether the people behind it even know Taras Vadroy exists. They have an automated tool that they import these, these systems into and say, go attack these 1,000 sites. And whoever I get into, then, then I win. So Taras Vadroy maybe have, has been one of them. Terry Cutler does think Taras Vadroy needs to beef up its online security. If people are going to get the impression that they can't secure their website, well, what else can't they secure? While town officials are concerned their website was hacked, they doubt any sensitive information was stolen. Regardless, they are taking measures to make sure this doesn't happen again. It's been rectified and the investigation is ongoing with the SQ. Ron Kelly says the attack was through the town's external server, where no classified documents or personal information is available. But it was enough to put a massive scare in this quiet residential neighborhood. Tim Sargent, Global News, Taras Fadroy.